10 Quick and Easy Ways to Eat Foods Healthy 1. Harissa How to eat it It's super versatile and can be dotted onto fried eggs, mixed into soups or stews, mashed into potatoes the list goes on. Here's one recipe, whole roasted carrots with black lentils and green harissa. 2. Goat Cheese How to eat it However you like it this recipe combines other healthy superstar ingredients, 2. Quinoa stuffed kale rolls with goat cheese. 3. Popcorn. How to eat it. Try making your popcorn on the stove, it's simple and fast. Instead of butter, sprinkle some parmesan and a little salt. 4. Coconut. How to eat it. Keep unsweetened shredded coconut in your fridge and sprinkle it on a raw kale or collard green salad. With a tangy vinaigrette on top it's just delicious, and the small amount of fat it adds makes the salad's nutrients more bioavailable. 5. Grass-fed beef. How to eat it. Whatever cut you like, prepared as you normally would. We also like this, grass-fed beef tenderloin steaks with sautéed mushrooms. 6. Ghee. How to eat it. Use ghee as a cooking tool for a new flavor and a commendable nutritional profile. 7. Canned Salmon. How to eat it. Canned salmon contains the small salmon bones, and you'll definitely want to eat them they're a great source of calcium that our bodies can more easily absorb than plant sources of calcium. Frying salmon burgers with breadcrumbs, eggs, spices, lemon zest and canned salmon couldn't be easier. 8. Spirulina. How to eat it. Add a teaspoon to your morning smoothie or oatmeal. 9. Lemon. How to eat it. The easiest way to get vitamin C into your diet without taking pills is to drink lemon water. It's tasty, satisfying and some people swear that if you drink it in the morning, it kickstarts digestion for the day. More evidence is needed but it can't hurt and it tastes great. 10. Tofu. How to eat it. Try the soft kind of tofu that has the consistency of jelly. It's great raw in salads instead of hard-boiled eggs, and you can slice it and dredge in a little egg wash and pan fry for a great appetizer. Top with soy sauce mixed with sesame oil, green onion, and black pepper and if you like it spicy, a little sriracha. Thanks for whacking. Subscribe our channel for more information.